Teresa Bryant here with your first alert weather 24 seven forecast and our snow moved through during the overnight hours coming to an end early this morning, leaving behind about one to three inch snowfall totals across much of our viewing area. 1.7 at the Quad City Airport in Moline, three inches of snow in Burlington, 2.5 in New London, 3.5 inches of snowfall in the Macomb area. Now that that snow has moved off to the east, we'll see lingering cloud cover through the rest of the day. Gradual clearing taking place through the overnight hours as we head into Tuesday and some cool sunshine on tap through the middle of the work week. So right now looking at that cloud cover as it continues to thicken up across much of the region, that's going to linger through this afternoon and into this evening before we see things starting to clear out late tonight and into early Tuesday. Plenty of sunshine expected during the day. But uh, temperatures still a little bit on the chilly side all the same. For today, we're looking at highs ranging from the 20s north into the lower 30s for our southern counties. 29 degrees expected in Dubuque, 31 in Savannah, 30 degrees in Tipton. We'll see a high near 32 degrees in Princeton, 31 in Macomb and Alito, as well as Mount Pleasant looking for a reading of 29 degrees in Washington. The Quad City is expecting a high near the 30 degree mark. Look for mostly cloudy and cold conditions today. Gradual clearing taking place during the overnight hours with lows near 15 degrees. Daytime highs back near the freezing mark. We'll see mostly sunny skies, cool conditions through the afternoon and highs near 32 degrees. Now we'll look ahead and temperatures still on the chilly side through Wednesday. We'll see sunshine temperatures in the 20s and then we're back in the 30s for Thursday and temperatures warming into the 40s by the end of the work week.